Nothing like turning the key and entering that first home of your own. The Martinez Gill family just became proud first time homeowners thanks to Habitat for Humanity's latest home build in Watts. I was worried about my kids and I have to send them far to school because I was wanting them to break the cycle of poverty. I was wanting them to succeed in life, not to go through my, my same situation. It's an emotional moment, not only for Martina's Gill, but for her four children, her son-in-law, and perhaps even their dog, Zuko. Just the little things, and to, as to me as the oldest, this really brings a lot of relief in my heart that my siblings have a safe place to live, that they have space to grow. Martina's Gill, a single mom, often has to work up to 20 hours a day at two different custodial jobs to support her kids and make ends meet. She never thought this dream house, a three-bedroom, two-bath, state-of-the-art home, could become reality. Yes, this is not a free house. This is a, not a, how they call it, it's not a hand off, it's a hand up. You have to pay mortgage like another family, it's just more affordable because they help you. So our families are um, typically working families that have a steady income but not enough to buy a house in the traditional market. In exchange for the help, families put in sweat equity, helping to build their own homes as well as others' homes. Around here, raising your hand and volunteering to help is what it's all about. Painting, nail, uh, uh, frames. So you, you, learn learn how to, you learn how to build a house? <laughs> yes, actually. They, they taught me. I didn't know how. Two of the kids are still living at home, so they will be living here with mom. And of course, we can't leave Zuko out. He'll live here too. This is going to be her room. And your room? Right there. And your mom's? Right there. So you each have your own room? Oh, yeah. What is that? Is that great? Yeah. Don't have to share a room anymore. The Martinez Gill family has plenty of company. In fact, all the houses across the street from them are Habitat for Humanity homes. Former President Jimmy Carter and his wife Rosalind helped build some two dozen of these homes in 1995. Habitat really helps bring a whole community up. And it all starts with a brand new key and a brand new home. I'm Anna Marcos for LA This Week.